Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to discuss about the topic, how is software testing career in Australia? So I have worked in India and it was for a quite a while. So basically eight to nine years in India and then moved to Australia. So it has been almost 10 years working in Australia as well. So my own personal experience, I'll be sharing how is overall software testing as a career option in Australia and what sort of things that you need to basically learn or skills that you need to have to get the job easily here in Australia. So overall, my personal experience is that software testing is a fantastic career option in Australia. And if you guys are watching from anywhere across the world and are thinking to come to Australia or are speculating or not able to decide whether you will be able to get job or there are much career options or much software testing jobs in Australia. So from my personal experience, I have seen that there are always, always software testing jobs available. If a person is coming as an experienced candidate from overseas, either you are coming from the on-site opportunity from your organization. Okay. In that case, you might be bound to the company or if you are coming as a permanent resident that you have got the visa overseas, you have some experience uh, overseas and only if you have experience, then you basically go ahead with that PR permanent residency process. So that is a you know, sort of a lengthy process. You need to have a local experience and then apply for PR. And then once you get the permanent residency visa, you can come here and find the work, right? That's the whole purpose of that permanent residency visa that you are getting a permanent or Australia is accepting you as a permanent resident and you can come and go anytime. Uh, there are some clauses, which is not the point of this discussion. So for the person who is trying to basically find the work when you are sitting outside, say, for example, many people think that once you got, got the permanent residency visa and the job market, the way it works back in India or back in your country will work exactly similar way here in Australia as well. So that is a bit different. I had a similar experience that yes, as in when I used to find work in India, it was a totally different experience. Once you upload the job, upload your resume in the job portal, you will start getting calls from the recruiters and interviews will start getting scheduled. It's a bit different here, but overall the jobs or the if you go ahead and see the jobs over the LinkedIn in the job portal, you will see absolutely massive amount of software testing jobs available. IT market has grown since I came here. And initially when I came here, it took a little while, eight to 10 weeks to crack the first job in the Australian market. But after that, it has never been a problem at all. It has never been a break, I would say. So I've done contracting. After a contract, one contract finished, immediately I got another one. So it's not a problem wherein you won't be getting calls once you have a little amount of experience here, right? So once you have some experience, absolutely you are going to get a lot of calls, right? So the job market is really good. Software testing market is really good here. Uh, but even if you're coming as an experienced tester and especially having the automation skills, that is important, right? So having the right set of skills is important. So with the right set of skills, if you don't have, if you learn and acquire those skills and you are able to showcase those in the, in the, in your interview here, you are, you are absolutely going to find that within two to three months of coming here, you will be able to crack the job. The max I have seen my known contact and it's the known contact. Basically they have took to find the job is six to eight months, right? That's the buffer that you have to take, especially if you're moving to a new country. If you're coming as an on-site person, then you don't have to obviously struggle with any of these problems that usually a person who is migrating on a permanent visa faces. So that's the overall crux of it in terms of job availability, software testing, massive amount of job. You just need to have the right visa. Okay. The first thing is the right visa, the work permits, and then the right skills. So if a company is requiring a software tester, they would expect you to have the API testing skill. They would expect you to have the automation skill. Maybe Make sure you have all of that in your resume and you will be absolutely fine in finding a new job here in Australia. Now, if you are on a visa, which is 
from the company that you migrated to or uh, from the company that has brought you here on the on-site work that visa or working or switching on that particular work visa might be tricky right that is not easy but if you have a permanent residency visa or you have converted to a, a citizen here then absolutely you have ample opportunities because you're not bound to an employer you are flexible and you have all the rights to live permanently and work permanently here in australia if you have the permanent residency visa and um, eventually you will get converted into the citizen if you opt for right so with the right skill set right visa there are ample software testing jobs available here in australia so that's all for this particular video i hope this was helpful thank you very much for watching